Yeah. I'll give a f what f you then, bitch. Don't mute that. Bitch. You can hang that up. It's all good. Probably not. Hey, delete that part. Delete that part. <laughs> what are you even talking about? That's a different conversation. Thank you so stupid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are now tuned into the twist. On You Film Me TV, this is not your grandmother's cup of tea. Welcome to another episode of The Twist. On You Film Me TV. It's not your ordinary podcast. It's a squad cast. And if you hold it. It's a guy cast. And if you gang gang. It's a mob cast. It is me, Real Beats, a.k.a. Chef Boyard Beats. Got my boy Pete. The delays is crazy. <laughs> I'm double coked up uh, per usual. Yankee fitted on because it's part of the uniform. And today I got on phone posits. Shout out to phone posits. Okay. Yeah. Got my girl, little Susie Vert. <laughs> yeah. <AKA Jay. laughs> no. Okay. Yeah. Got my girl, Jay. AKA 10 nail shotting because I like white. Okay. If it's white, it's right. If it's... No. <laughs> Careful. Uh, Wait, what color? I thought your nails were like pink or something. No. Nah. I thought it's... you said they were baby powder pink or something. No. As it, this is called Funny Bunny. It's like a milky white. Oh, okay. It's the same color as my toes. Okay. Do it still look pink? Well, well the you light know we got the lighting in here. But um, you were saying something about phone posits early. So has the phone posits really made their comeback yet? No. Like it's like been a few releases It's been a few The blue come out This year right Yeah, yeah. But I got the Like the electric blue ones Is that electric nah, just that's, No that's, a, that's like I'm Hyper sorry. Royals <laughs> Nah just go ahead just fucking Oh yeah Michael you. Just a little bit beat Oh damn Yeah Did I curse I did curse Nah nah did, Yeah I mean, we way past oh, Okay cool I've, I've noticed a lot of creators Gotta know Go the past like Two to maybe five minutes Before they start using profanity yeah. But I mean We've been doing this for a while So I kind of know the ins and outs nah, oh, Okay yeah, cool yeah, Hey y'all better get on y'all shit yeah. But, but um, the, the, the No the, the royal Is coming I don't know that's if that's what it is. considered the I think it's royal Yeah Yeah those yeah, the ones coming. I really wanted yeah. I got the anniversary Pair I think The one that came 20 years after mm-hmm. So 2016 Yeah But they Nike's I think Nike's desperate yeah, we about to talk about it. Because they putting out heat. Ah, uh, that ain't even it. Did you see what they doing to the shoe surgeon? Oh, mm-hmm. yeah, they like, suing them. Like 60. 60. Is it million? Or? No, 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 60 million. Who is this? 60 million? Yeah, 60, 60 million. That's crazy. Shoe surgeon is the guy who uh, teaches the class on how to customize like dunks and, and Jordan 1s and stuff. So like he'll, he'll do them. And uh, now he t- then he teaches the class. I think the class anywhere from like three to five thousand, mm. and he making bread. So yeah. that now they about to hit him with infringement. And I'm like, why don't y'all instead of doing that, why don't y'all just do a collab with him right. and make all that money? Right. Y'all gonna sue the man? And I don't know. I ain't, can't count his pockets to say he don't have sixty million. But that's crazy. But it's so many other people out here. You going after him? Like I said, the smart thing would have been to do a collaboration with him. Right. But y'all, y'all could have literally had this man on y'all team because he be doing some fire shit. Nah, I mean, so what, so, I mean, but they're still buying the shoes from Nike and just customizing no. them. No. I think he make them shit. He like, he got them. there. Oh. Yeah, he, he's them from it. scratch. Yeah. Oh. So that, Which is, it's not a hard thing to do. Is he actually putting the Nike thing on it? Yes. Yeah. Oh, dang. Like you would think see that, that that's where it gets yeah. tricky, and that, yeah. that's why because I would you say, don't. Wait, wait, okay, bad, no, you good. Because I don't think you have that. Yeah, oh, okay. I don't think you, <laughs> you have that permission to use the logo, the logo yeah. freely. Yeah. yeah, you know what I'm saying. You just can't slap a Nike sign on everything. Yeah. The same can. And I saw somebody say the same can be said for when you customizing shoes because their logo is still on there. Yeah. So, like I said, if you if you want a career in this, you got to be careful about getting too big because once they see, you, I think, I, yeah, I think it's the profit. Portion. Yeah. It's like, oh, hey, hold up, hold up now. We ain't making nothing. Yeah, through 3,000 yeah. to 5,000, you get 100 people. Yeah. That's, you know what I'm saying? I, do you feel like it'd be different if he was just buying that? Just say if he was buying a white uh, dunk and customizing like that, would it be different? I feel like it wouldn't be as, as, as harsh. It would be different, but it's it's that it's that logo. Yeah. It's that, that silhouette. Yeah. You could trace it back to Nike. Yeah. You can't really trace it back to anywhere else. This is the same thing we happened with uh with Bape. Yeah. Like that Bape stuff, it's identical to that yeah, Air Force One. Yeah. 
So you you could trace that model back to Nike. You can't really trace it nowhere else. So I'm sure Nike has the paperwork in Oregon somewhere. Like, yo, this is, you know what I'm saying? This is the original, whatever, whatever, whatever. So so with that, I mean, like, how is that any different from the car game? You riding, like, I remember when my mom got her car in like 20, <clears throat> 2000, I don't know what it was, but it was the... It was a Nissan Maxima when they changed the body style. Uh-huh. And then Lexus came out with one that was like the same body style. I think, uh, I don't know, Toyota makes Avalon, that car? Yeah. They came out with one that was like the exact same body style. So how can they get away with it when if a shoe person do it, now it's infringing? Probably because they they putting their own logo on it and not advertising someone else's okay, logo. Okay, yeah. But, but, but literally, like he said, how you trace it back to the silhouette, yeah. oh, it's, yeah. it's still like the same shape. See, but Toyota, Lexus, and all of them, they're under the parent. That's it's under right. the same company. That's right. The only thing you could really sue them for is color. Mm. I think certain groups have patented color. Mm. Don't quote me. Get your facts from somewhere else. Yeah, this is a podcast. Yeah, now, I don't fact we check. We wrong. Yeah, <laughs> I, I just overheard that, yo, like certain colors are patented by that company. So mm-hmm. like Nissan could have like a silver, pearl, silver. Uh, Ford then can't go use that same thing because it's patented by Nissan. Gotcha. Yeah. Yeah, because then that would make people want to like buy from the other companies because of the color that they have. Yeah. So what do y'all think the shoe surgeon should go from here just start his own like silhouette? It just, bro, like, Try to find something new. Nike cornered damn near the market for sneakers because they've been around for so long. It's it's hard to do a new silhouette. What I would say is just yeah. go to Adidas. I, I, Adidas, I feel like Adidas gives people more freedom. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, so I still that. feel like he can do it. But like I said, the only thing you would have to cut out, in my opinion, is making them from scratch. Like if you buying them and customizing them, like that's different. Yeah, yeah, because make, they still getting a profit off right, the shoe. Yeah, you because you still got to buy the shoe. Right now, when you put just the make it from scratch. Yeah, and like and 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 again, I just think it's really about design. Yeah, because yeah, you could you could create a dunk silhouette, but if it don't have that Nike sign, eh, I don't really care. <clears throat> yeah, because you're saying that this is the shoe that you created when you didn't. Right, because yeah. if you ever look at the shoe, uh, the sites that be selling like the the reps and shit, yeah. when they advertise the shoe, they have the silhouette. They don't have the Nike, Nike check on yeah. it. Yeah. So it's but once just, you get it, the check on it. So yeah. Still yeah. infringing. And I feel like <clears throat> Jordan's uh, Nike Dunks, like those are the easiest things to copy. Probably the easiest things to make. Yeah. Like you don't see a lot of rep foams or rep. Yeah, you don't. I ain't saying that they ain't out there. Yeah, I ain't saying that yeah. they ain't out there, but it ain't just like a, a majority. Yeah, yeah, like a thing. Okay. But, yeah, you see a lot of rep, uh, Louis Vuitton sneakers and Balenci- Balenciaga sneakers, Gucci sneakers and everything like that. But, I don't know, man. Nike coming for theirs. Like, just, so, just so be with careful. the lawsuit number, like, is that number based off a number they assume you made off that shit? Or that number just say like, man... Fuck him. We getting sixty million out of you, but I only make sixty a year. Yeah, it's probably both. Mm. <laughs> we gonna crazy. take we gonna take homie for for everything he got. Nah. And it's just like, hey man, listen, that's, that's wild. Yeah, listen, but if he can pay that sixty million, that mean he got bread from doing this shit because he done customized from like he hella celebrities. And everybody, shit. Yeah. it's it's a it's a girl now that does cleats for um for uh football players. And but she like that. she paint and shit though, right? Yeah, but. It's a difference. Yeah. I, I don't know why I said that, but it is a difference because she's probably buying it from yeah, Nike. Indeed. Okay. Or Nike's at or Nike is actually supplying her with the shoe. Yeah. With certain, you know, stipulations or anything like that. Like you re you can't recreate the shoe. You can only do whatever, whatever. Yeah. You can't alter so the it's, it's a tricky game, man. <clears throat> yeah, because it'd be different. Like if somebody asked me to customize a shoe like with the colors of a shoe that's already made because they missed out on the shoe or something. Yeah. Like I, I wouldn't do that. I mean, technically you could because Nike ID allows you to do that. Yeah. Well, at least I think. I yeah, don't know. but I don't. I feel like that's different though because that's like through them. Yeah. You know, but you can't. But it's not exactly the same shoe that you miss when you go on Nike ID to make a shoe. Like it's certain things on it that's not gonna that you're not gonna have because I tried it when I missed one shoe and I, I think I missed the um 
the lime green 95s. Mm-hmm. I really wanted them. So I tried to go on Nike ID to recreate oh, you can't, it. You can't nah, do it. Yeah, you can't yeah, do it. You're going to have your Instagram name on it. <laughs> no, nah, I'm saying like when I went on Nike ID, they wouldn't allow me. Like the bottom of the shoe, like the whole shoe was lime green, but the bottom was white. But in the original one, the whole shoe is lime green. Yeah. Yeah, you, you so you, he's not gonna allow okay. you to do it. Limited do certain ones, but yeah, yeah. I mean, we we see Nike copy colorways. Yeah, have you seen Nike copy colorway with that uh that Nike Easy the black? Yeah, the black with the lime green. Mm-hmm. We seen them put that on a Nike Roshi a phone posit. We yeah. seen them do all of that. Kind of yeah. like when they used to drop like the packs. Yeah, like yeah, yeah, like the pack. But okay, listen, man. Nikes, they they do what they want. That's right. Yeah. Nike going broke, y'all. Y'all better start uh, copying the fortune. Yeah, <laughs> but the thing <laughs> is, like, we still gonna buy them. But yeah. the thing is, too, like, <laughs> like the prices of the shoes are like really ridiculous. Just to think how it went from how we started at. For my shoes, it was ninety dollars. I about to say ninety dollars was men's Air Forces, or was it eighty at first? No, it was eighty at first. 70. Yeah, 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 seventy. And no, seventy was for kids, and it was like eighty five for men. Because one twenty for forces. Yeah, because like when I started working in the shoe store, it was in twenty ten. My for my size for Jordans, it was like ninety bucks. Like bucks. for retros, yeah, it was ninety yeah, bucks. Some savings right there. Yeah, <laughs> ninety bucks for some retros. But like as like when we exited the, the shoe game, like it went up to like one hundred and sixty dollars, one hundred seventy dollars. That's way more expensive, dollars. right? And that's right, and that's nuts <laughs> because it's like dang, like like knowing that this is where you were, you only went up because it is like you could still go there. Yeah, you know. Shout Can out I? to that man who sell the Arizona's. I oh mean, yeah, shout out to him, but. Yeah. As materials change, as prices of material change, wouldn't you have to charge more? I mean, I can understand like more, but not just like, ten times more because they make because shoes like what? How much it costs them to make the shoes? Let me interject right well, here. Uh-huh. Everybody has to make a. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I was about to say this is where we come down to the black owned business and shit. Now, yeah. if you was buying from your black owned people. If they offered these supplies, it might be different. But that's why I said this is where it comes in to where we yeah. have to work with each other to get supplies. Every, everything black, we don't have everything in the black owned community. Like, right. I I'm, mean, I'm sure there's some people out here making, you know, materials, but. Right. I mean, it's like, like there are black owned, you know, shoe businesses that can have it, but it just costs them more to get the stuff as, as opposed to like Nike to where they can like buy stuff in. Bulk or whatever Because they got that contract Yeah But for us To to get it It's going to cost a little more So the shoe's going to have to cost more No, I understand what you're saying Like when you say Everybody needs a profit But some of the prices That they're like placing are, Aren't profits It's greed Because it's like That's America yeah. Right? No, I understand that But I'm just saying Like you're saying Everybody has to make a profit Yeah, but you're trying to make A hundred times the profit Cause if it only costs you like twenty dollars to make the shoe, and then you charging two twenty five for the shoe, I'm like, and then it's not even the same material as it was back then, cause it was much better then than it is now. Yeah, but most of the materials were sourced from Taiwan, and yeah. you don't know the laws in Taiwan now to where they can't get those materials. Yeah, America. So now you have to try to outsource, and now that other countries know you're desperate, yo, it's you gonna pay? Is yeah, supply and demand. It's a thousand x times for this, right? So now we got to charge more for the shoe because we need we need this material to keep making money. Yeah. So so like I like I I really get what you're saying because it used to cost me a hundred dollars for Tim's now they two ten. Yeah. So I, I I really get what you're saying, but same materials. Yeah, but you just don't know like because like if you look at the Jordans from way back when they was made in Taiwan, if you look at them now, it's made in China. The quality definitely changed, but the I feel quality like it's less quality. Much different. Yeah, yeah. now yeah. the quality is terrible because I was looking at some of my mom's shoes. Shoot, her first uh, pair of Jordans that she got was from like 91. And I was looking at the quality of those compared to the ones she have now, like to today's. I'm like, man, like even the shoestrings were different. I'm like, every, like the quality of that shoe, I mean, of course, like it's like she put her foot in it, it's gonna come out She's because, disintegrate. right? I'm like, because it's from, <laughs> right? Because it's from the freaking 90, right? But it's because it's from 91. But if I look at the quality of a shoe from 91 and then the quality of a shoe from 2020, I mean, from 22, it's like, dang, like you this shoe is much better. Yeah, it was real, everything. And, and, and I also think that Nike just puts out way too much. Yeah. 
So if if they would slow down, I think the quality would be. Oh, better. that's crazy! I passed by uh finish line uh for Thursday. They got Jordan 13s in the window and dunks on the mannequin. Now when we was working there, we couldn't even do that shit. Yeah, that's how you know the shit down. Yeah, yeah but bad. like people then um I'm sorry. Yeah, but people then talk down on pandas so much that now don't nobody want to be Sit seen in them. Yeah. Cause like you remember that video I that. when I was like, "Will you talk to her? like what shoe do you would you not talk to Everybody like, like yeah like if a girl yeah. wore this shoe what shoe would it be you want to talk to her oh the pandas that's what? The, like I said that's that hype shit like I I never fell into that yeah like I'm still gonna put my the, pandas on regardless the, the A6 and the New Balance that everybody wearing right now them shit look like oh them look like mall walkers to me so it's a hype thing it's the cool thing to do I yeah put them on my I, feet. I, I put bought them on two pairs of A6s and a new a pair of New Balances when. They weren't really wearing that. Yeah. Right. I bought A6 but, then. I love A6 if I'm cool. gonna be honest. Yeah. So now I'm kinda like, okay, but I've been Been had it. Yeah. Like like Because if you really a sneaker, you know what I'm saying? Like if you really do this shit for real, then it's like, bro, you buy everything. I was the same way with camo. When my first couple of years of college, I was wearing camo bro. People was like, Why the fuck do you wear that? Then Wiz Khalifa came out and said it in what, twenty fourteen? Yeah. Mind camo you, I'm wearing wear this shit in like oh nine, oh eight. Yeah, we and, it was on camo. Yeah, was on yeah I was on camo and freaking uh, I was on camo. yeah, seven and eight. Yeah, yeah. They, they started making fun of me. Then Wiz Khalifa came out. I said, "Oh, now it's cool." Yeah, I've been in the army. Yeah. I've been in the <laughs> army. Been in the, been people made people been made fun of me for wearing Vans in high school. For real? Now look, look. It's the norm. It's the norm now. That's why I said, "Oh, you point. see mad black people in Vans." Man, if they came back out with Sacconis, I'd wear them. I like give me some Sacconis. I don't like the newer really style well? though. I like the older style. They they got the what's homie that that do the Sacconis? Is that even how you pronounce that shit, y'all? Oh, it's right. Sacconis, Sacconi. Yeah, I just call them Sacconis. Sacconis. J J J Fresh Tips. I don't know if y'all know, but that's his got, name. Yeah, pause. Fresh I, tips. Yeah, yeah, Fresh <laughs> Tips is crazy. <laughs> but yeah, he he got a collab. I don't mm-hmm. really see people going crazy. Like people just yeah I don't, I don't know go man I, I don't care yeah I don't, I don't know. know I'm I just put don't on, care bro I'm gonna put on such a colonies only thing I'm not putting up well the old version of Feliz like I really love the old like when they first first came Never out like huh Never owned a pair no I had a pair of, but you know that it was the thing then and my mom was like we gonna get you these. like that's that's what my mom was so I said oh, she's not here that's what my mama is like yeah. we're gonna get. You know what's happening right now because y'all ain't finna look at my kids like they whatever. This was like when I was in like what sixth, seventh grade. I was about to say, <laughs> so I don't know where you that was. No, nah, I was gonna say, I remember feeling like I was being popular. Yeah, but this was like when I was in fucking probably third, second, third grade. I my, never put my foot in no few. Well, 96 because Grant Hill was wearing them shits. Like that's when I, I mean, yeah, but they still were like really popular. like like in Rome, you know, so Oh, that's why. Yeah, that's <laughs> why. Hey, hey. So Rome like six years late. <laughs> So like well, <laughs> Shut up. So my mama went It's a time skip. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so my mama would come home like you know with the felines, I went to school, boy, what? Like who are you? Rome, Rome got the blip. Yeah. Yeah, like back, it's like traveling back in time. Like, hey, what the man riding on his horse in the middle of the <laughs> Nah, but like that silhouette was my favorite. When they came out with with these other silhouettes and stuff, I was Tell like, me the mm. "Yeah, like this, I, I ain't trying to do that." <laughs> no, I want these to be lies. <laughs> they look like um, I, I can't. They look like some G shocks or something. Yeah. I don't know. When they when they G shocks, <laughs> when they watch. <laughs> Yeah, the, yeah, but the, the shoe looked like how the the brim of that watch is. Okay, all right. I mean, hey. I'm about to say that's that's when uh. I don't know what the hell America was on then. <laughs> the big ass clothes with the A hats with the lowercase A's and them felines. I was like, yo, what are y'all doing right now? It was on that Snap era, boy. Yeah. That was a nasty era. It was. Good music, but the I was fashion like, Snap sense, era yeah. was, you know. Fashion yeah. sense was crazy. Fashion yeah. sense was nuts. I had a 4XT. Oh, when man. I only weighed like 95 pounds. <laughs> yo, when Dipset brought out the, the wallet chains? I had one, but I didn't really just wear it every day. I wore it every day. I used to get in trouble for school for wearing that. Dang. We got in trouble for wearing a snowman shirt. It could be a weapon. I'm like, yeah, yeah snowman shirt could be it a can, weapon. But I'm not. Yeah. Well, a snowman shirt, they caught you wearing it. You had to uh, turn it inside out. Yeah. 
Like, like I can't see that uh, right. screen print. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I can't it see was, the zero. And the, I mean, the circle, circle, circle. Yeah. There were certain hats we couldn't wear. We couldn't wear hats at all in school. Nah, bro. See, and, and that's what I was gonna say earlier when we was talking about uh, we was talking about supplies and all that shit. Uh, when they say like America, the land of the free, it ain't <laughs> the supplies it's, and shit. Right. You're free to be gay. That's what it is, y'all. That's what it is, y'all. You're free to be... No, I'm just playing. No, but when they say <laughs> land of the free, you're free to be who you are, I'm guessing. Yeah, because, yeah supposed it don't to apply be. to money. <laughs> yeah, I mean. <laughs> nah, you free to be gay. <laughs> that's what you want to do. Yeah. Yo, only being free to be gay is crazy. <laughs> yeah, you ain't free to do nothing. Yeah. You gotta pay taxes, all that shit. Yeah. You free to be gay though. But you but free be to be who gay. you want to be. So yeah, you free to I, be I understand. Gay, like that's what America is all about. Like I said, so many people move here because you got other countries where you can't do these type of. I think you can be free for a price. Yeah, you can be free in your house all day. Yeah, so huh? you come outside. Hey, what you doing? Get back in line. <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay. Which brings me to this thought I have. Like, why people just don't, like, ride horses? Now? Yeah. Like, I see, like, so many people, like, in my area just with horses. Bro, like, just ride the horse. They do downtown. They, but I be wondering, like, how they get there? They ride it all the way there or just put them in the trailer and park and then get out Probably put them in the trailer park. Can you imagine the kind of traffic we would have with everybody on horses? Yeah. No. Imagine your horse getting hit by somebody else's horse. <laughs> right? <laughs> Because your horse is like beefing with this horse Man. and they just fight like, yo, that would be crazy to see a highway full of horses. That shit would be loud as hell, everybody. Yeah. Five the o'clock clunk, 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 clunk. Yeah, you can't listen. You, can't, you, can't, listen. Get over. you can't listen to no music. You can't. You can't. Yeah. Uh, my new uh, Ray-Ban yeah. Miller glass. <laughs> Not, uh, but, but can you imagine how many other people would have their music playing and then like big speakers and everything? Oh, yeah, like the, the motorcycles. Yeah, like the motorcycles. <laughs> Everybody yeah. want to ride horses though. It only be yeah. you got to fit in. <laughs> no, I'm saying no like horse, there's no way we can have what? horses and cars on the highway. What like, if they, they had no a uh, HOV lane, but the H stand for horse? horse that'd be fire. Horses, horses. Yeah, on yeah that'd be fire. <laughs> you see me? You see me out here <laughs> yeah, <laughs> on like, some Red Dead Redemption shit? I'm finna get in the uh, goddamn horse lane. But also, can horses like can they trot at uh, 75 miles per hour? Probably not that fast. Probably not like, that fast. It's like between 35 I'm, to 40. Right, yeah, because I'm how sure. long would it take me to get to work? <laughs> they can't, Just you know. Just closer to work. <laughs> Okay. I wouldn't really be tripping. I ain't paying no gas, though. So yeah, but you hard, say, yeah. but you saying that like yeah. that's just easy. To leave earlier? No, to live closer <laughs> to work. <laughs> No, like, I, it ain't that easy to just I get a house closer to the your job. Worst part about me is be coming out of the garage with my horse. <laughs> like, mm. <laughs> <laughs> right? Uh, yeah. Shout out to horse. Set up a stable. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on tight. Right, as many times as I run back in the house, yeah. and then like the stuff I carry, like carrying your lunch and stuff. Yeah, especially how we got, got caught in the rain yesterday. Ooh man, get the, all my paperwork wet. Like, well, I, I did my assignment. <laughs> <laughs> Here it is. Yeah, man, man, shout I don't, out to horses. And I also don't think they'd be able to travel just long distances. And like, where are we gonna get their food? Like on, to refuel the them, and they gotta go to sleep. Yeah, pet smart. I'm pretty yeah. sure they'll start selling something. Yeah. Like, they the world's gonna accommodate for the horses, man. <laughs> they eat grass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they eat grass yeah. everywhere. Got supply everywhere. Yeah. And let the deer tell it the best grass is on the side of the highway because that's where they be all the time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. People used to ride horses all the time. Yeah, yeah they did. Yeah. But they also were like in their... Well, no, because some people travel farther. It was only 100 uh, years ago. <laughs> the only person be running into a problem is you, because you be all over the goddamn world. Right, I be everywhere. My horse... I keep my commute short. My horse would be tired. It would be sick of me. Yeah. Just imagine going to Linux and you come outside somebody that broke into your horse. Somebody that chainsaw the horse. Now you gotta ride the horse bareback. <laughs> yeah. It took my damn <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. I think the good thing I think about that, though, is I think I I know the horses would like fight back. It's like you ain't still, because they know their owner. What are you, a gladiator? Yeah. What are you talking about? No, I'm saying like if somebody tried to steal your horse, Why like you in your, the yeah, like your horse, like the horse knows their owner. I so know. I feel like they kind of would like fight that. because like if you're like, shoot, like when you think about it, when you go to a, uh, like I, I don't, I'm pretty sure you've never I, been to one. Yeah, but I ain't gonna lie. I'm a horse, everything you're saying right now. I, feel like <laughs> I can steal a horse. I ain't gonna lie to you. 
But go ahead, go off, sis. Go off, sis. Go off, sis is crazy. Yeah, that was raggedy. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> but no, I'm saying like when you go to like a, a horse, like a horse stable, and like to actually like ride horses, mm -hmm. like the person who like trains the horses and stuff, like they have to be with you. Like even riding with you and everything else, like just to make sure like everything is fine and let the horse know it's okay. Because like like I seen one video as soon as the like the the um trainer left the horse, that horse went crazy on the person that was on the end and then kicked them off they they back. I feel like I could do it. How would you do it? Oh, I ain't getting on his back. I'm just gonna <laughs> go grab the what do you call it, the reins? Yeah. <laughs> they walk him out. Oh, yeah, oh so gonna, you think it's that easy? He's gonna, he's gonna right. walk him out. Yeah, walk him out. <laughs> if he can outrun an alligator, you telling me this is too crazy? Like, come on now. No, I'm saying like you I just think it's. Can outrun out, yeah. <laughs> no, I'm saying but I'm you still just, on it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, but I'm saying you think it's that easy. <laughs> yeah, like hey, I, I, listen, listen. It, it's Break good. it down, brother. It's good Please, it's friends that we are, man. I hate how y'all just don't. No, 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 no. I never said I didn't. No, I no, believe. No. no, no, wait, wait, wait. I believe that you could have made it across that highway that one time. Okay, because yeah, <laughs> you my man. Well, for know, I tried to cross the highway one day. And we'll, we'll tell the story later. I tried to cross the highway on foot, and my family didn't believe in me, y'all. No, I just said I was going with you, and you went going because you, you, you wasn't going. So whatever, ass. whatever. I was going. And then with we would have had to explain that to your mom. Yeah. yeah you I would have looked back and you would have had uh, only two lives left. <laughs> yeah, I was going. I was going cross with you. Like that's just what it was. You was slowing me down. Yeah, I mean, it didn't matter. I was finna. I was finna cross road yeah, with you. See, you, you see, but you didn't want to do it because you didn't want me to cross with you. Well, because I'm responsible for me. Yeah. Now, if I look back and your crock then came off on the middle of the highway, I'm not coming back. I'm finna. <laughs> You yeah. definitely could have made it across yeah, the highway. Yeah, you could. Yeah, made it. we was gonna make it across no, the highway. No, 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 no. I would took my shoes off. No, no, no but I had See, on sneakers. But, but, but that don't, don't make a difference. It don't matter. This no, you said my crock would have came up. I had on sneakers. Okay, it don't matter. I'm talking about speed, agility wise. I'm not saying you don't have it, but I can't. That's like trying to do a sack race across the highway. We gonna die. <laughs> If we tie together, no, we don't. Die. We wouldn't be tied together. I'm not saying you don't have it. Yeah, but I'm saying if you were to do it on your own without me having to look out for you, I'm not saying you couldn't make it. But I'm just saying if we trying to go, yeah, at but the same you didn't have to look out for me. I was, yeah, just, I was just letting you know that I was crossing with you. So you if you was gonna go, I was going no, 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 no. You wasn't crossing with me because yeah. my speed and ability would have left you. Right, that's <laughs> fine. Yeah. On, yeah. Right, that's fine. But I'm just saying I would have been behind you. No, yeah, but, but don't say with because. <laughs> you wasn't gonna be with me. I'd have burnt your head. <laughs> but the thing was, like, you had to go over the thing. Yeah, you got I don't know. Now that part I was gonna was climb little, up. Yeah, that shit was like a three feet wall. I, I would have did it, but like I said that would have been most tri yeah, tricky part for me. Yep, and I would have been climbing right on too. Yeah, you won. Yeah, I was. But mm -hmm. yeah, I don't know about that. But yeah, yeah. I mean, you ain't if, you. if you just want to lie on the pod, then yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, I, love I, I never said I was fast. I never said that because I'm not fast. But all I'm saying is, if you was if you was going cross <laughs> no, no. because the cars come faster than what they look. No, sweetheart, listen. But that's the thing. Yeah, you got to be fast. Yeah, no, I understand that. <laughs> and, but I'm but but you see how dangerous it was, like for y'all. To be like, no, like, little one, you can't go do Get this. on your mic. That's how dangerous y'all was saying, like, it would be for me. It's yeah. the same dangerous it was for him. No, no, it's not. <laughs> it wasn't. I'm qualified, but like, I grew up doing this, is what I'm telling you. This okay, all right, next time, time we get stranded on a highway, I will let you. That was a one time occurrence. We don't let that happen again. I will <laughs> let you cross the highway. I mean, we can go outside. I can do it right now. Like, no, but see, that don't count. Why that don't count? No, that don't count. Because it's not a major highway, like where it's four lanes on both sides. I cross, like, if you can do it in your car, why are you saying you can't do it on foot just because of the Because your car go faster. Yeah, but you use your the same Your car can judgment. go from zero to 25 in matter of seconds. Yeah, but you need to go faster you, than yeah, 25. Yeah, you cross when it's clear. But you if you have a time lapse from where you see all the cars. Yeah, I'm gone. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I Look, I want that. Yeah. I want that. Doesn't that you know it's gonna make fume, man. Fume. I'm gone. 
I want that Lightning McQueen. Yo, they got me the other day. Yo, look at this lightning strike a deer. Hey, I won't doubt you up. anymore. I'm just saying, I believe in myself. I ain't gonna do nothing. I don't feel like I can do. Man. Okay. Uh, we was on the plane. You was like, jump, man. We gonna land on that? Nah, hell no. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go ahead and show me. <laughs> See you do it first. Yeah. Cut and show me that jumping shit. Mm-mm. Running, yeah, but jumping, nah. I told you, I used to have my mama jump on Super Mario for me. I couldn't do that shit. <laughs> we have home VHS, y'all. We got home footage of me not being able to jump on Tiny Toons. I, like, I used to give my mama the controller. Can you get me across here? <laughs> <laughs> jump, <laughs> listen, bro, you have, you have to know your strength. Can't do it. Is speed and agility your strength? Yeah, right. my sister would tell you, I used to jump too early. Anytime we play them two player games, we got to jump at the same time. I was like, hey, <laughs> your time is off. Yeah, hey, because you're your shoulders. <laughs> <again."> yeah. <laughs> it's the future been fucking. Yeah, the future been fucking yeah, you up, right? man. Yeah, that's me all day. Oh man. Okay. Yeah. I gotta prove it. Yeah, I just have delusions, so yeah. Ain't too I, much believe, I, don't I, think I can do it myself. Yeah. Yeah. Now you are the, on the other hand, out that that particular day. Yeah. No, I, and like I said, I'm not saying you wouldn't have made it. You just wouldn't have made it at the same time as me. No, I know that. I'm not professing to be fast. I was just saying, if you're going to do something like this dangerous, then I'm going to do it too. Because I really didn't want you to do that. But no, but what, why though? That's what I'm saying. You Because trying... I was scared. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. I grew up doing this shit. Well, you never said, LaWanna, I got experience in this. I told you that. No, you said, I believe I can make it. You never no, said, I got I t- experience in I this. I told you I used to cross the highway on my bike. He did. Four lanes. You see, a really bite fire. is different than legs. No. And just running. I'm using the same judgment. It's not yeah. like I'm going to get in the car and just turn out in front of somebody just because I'm in a car now. I'm like, no, I'm using the same judgment. Yeah, because you would have to you would have to get a pedal start, though. Yeah. See, we Instead got, of just taking off. We got to go to like Air Adventure or something. You know how they have that little, I don't know what that obstacle course is, but it's the things that spin around and the little kids be jumping over there. Yeah. We got to go to one of those so I can prove to you. Like, I, I got it. Yeah, but you can't jump, so how would you do that? I can that? jump over that. <laughs> Y'all see, hey, I don't when, know. listen, when we went to the Ninja Warrior course, yeah, you see, Pete, did you not see me out I there? I see, I see you out there. You out there. Like your mama now, your mama. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, that's yeah. the cause here, no? <laughs> <laughs> Nah, you see me out there on the Ninja Warrior course? I did yeah. my thing. Come on now. I, I would, listen, I believe you couldn't yeah, have made it. I would have been back. Yeah. It was funny because my mama extra tipped the lady at, at my birthday party because she was asleep when we was bowling and the lady put the put her jacket over her and tucked her in. Okay. Big tip was. <laughs> right. So she was, was like, like, she was like, yeah, I gave her a good tip. She was good to me. Speaking of yeah. tipping, great segue. Uh, so foes. when we get food, and if we get it to go, do you tip Pete? Tip what? <laughs> like, like money? Yeah. Like, what do you mean? Well, you get a to-go order. You go pick it up yourself. You tip. Oh, no, nah, I don't do that. You don't tip? No, nah, I don't pick it up myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. Nah. Yeah, nah, we ain't doing that, brother. I got to order it. Nah. <laughs> nah, don't bring that to me. No, nah, I'm saying, if you go to her restaurant and you sit down and get Is a Is this plate. a hypothetical? More nah, or less. I mean, because it happened to us. Like, right. we, it just happened to us yesterday. Uh, we right. get some food and I was like, shit, let's just go. It was raining and shit. Yeah. Then when it it gave me the, the receipt and it said tip. I was like, hey, tip who? Because <laughs> I ain't getting no service, no water. I mean, I don't, like, I wouldn't have tipped nobody yesterday. It took us like 45 minutes to get our food. So in that in that instance, your uh your tip. I mean, that instance, I'm not tipping regardless because. Y'all took too damn long. But not even because you didn't take too long, but you, but why we were sitting here in the meantime waiting. Flies. Like, it was flies everywhere. No, it was flies everywhere. Yeah, because they had the thing up. But like you didn't say like, oh, do you want something to drink? Do you want no, he gave it? us like, that water. No, he did yeah. ask us, do we want something to drink? No, I'm talking about the other dude that actually like brought us our food because oh, yeah. that dude left and started serving tables. Yeah, they brought so us So I'm saying the other dude. Gave us the check. When it started shaking cocktails somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> started getting Get the oysters on the thing. Yeah, right. It took so long. Like there was there would have been no tip because it took no time for for me to have my card out or whatever and to do this because I'm already waiting on you. Mind you, he could have been gave us the receipt. Yeah, Ben gave us a we receipt there like years 30, ago. 40 minutes waiting on the We was there for forty five minutes. Paid. So 
So you're not tipping? No. No, nah, well, I'm tipping for it to go. Like only only way I would tip like for it to go order is if the person is like really like personal. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, I gave you extra blah 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 blah. Like because like this was okay. Well, I'm gonna give you a tip because like you really like cared about me enjoying my food. Yeah, when you put them plastic forks in there. Yeah, I mean not even that, but it's just like oh, I gave it's like five dollars. Like the last time I went to Longhorn, the girl um, was like, oh, with well, the sweet potato. Um, she was like, I gave you two sweet potatoes. She was like, but I don't think one of them's just the part. But I'm gonna just give you both of them anyway. This one's more fresh. I gave you extra brown sugar and cinnamon. Da da da. Like so, yeah. Tip, okay. Yeah, let me tip you because like you actually cared about me. But if they just come out and say, here's your food, thank you, no tip. I just just come out and be like. Jay, there you go. <laughs> right. What I'm tipping you for? Yep. Tip my damn self. Yeah. yeah, ain't no tip because I had to get up and come get the food. That's crazy. I feel that. If I order food, I ain't going to get it. I ain't going to pick, nah, pick it up. Nah, nah, come on. Nah, bring that. Swing that. <laughs> nah, I'll go pick it up. Nah. Like, well, still, you might as well just go there and eat. No, but I don't feel like like yeah, sitting there being there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> when you do that, then that's when it comes to the eighteen percent and twenty percent gratuity. Like especially, like I said, I just wanted to. I ain't want to be in all the noise. It was already raining and shit. I just want to yeah. get my food, go watch some TV. Yeah, and I didn't want to pay the Uber Eats um, delivery that. fee, tip nah. fee, because you still got to tip somebody regardless. So I'd rather just go pick it up so I don't have to tip nobody and just get my food and then come home. And if I want to, I can eat on the way home. Yeah, if I want to. That's yeah. true. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So we ain't tipping y'all. Um, mm-hmm. So yeah. th- this is a topic. Uh, you know, we don't speak too heavy on this whole relationship, what you bring to the table type shit. But I did want to ask your perspective of this. I'm staying. No, I was not. <laughs> 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 no, I wasn't about that. So, right, so I'm going to ask you first, Pete. When it comes to that whole man paying all the bills, 100%, this and that, like, where do you stand with that? If that's what works, sure. In your household, not speak for everybody else. In your household, do you feel like you gonna want to pay all the bills and she just cooking and clean and shit? Mm, to me, it's like okay, I'll pay the mortgage, but like all the other stuff, whoever get to it first. Like if you open it and the light bill is, let's say, how much is light bill? Like eighty dollars, bro. Just pay the eighty dollars. So do you want you don't you don't mind your woman working? No. Okay. Yeah. But like it's it's like we gonna if if you see the bill and you know I got a bad memory if you really know me <laughs> I'm gonna forget to pay the bill so if you see it and it's only eighty dollars why wouldn't you just because it's our money anyway pay it we together it's if we gotta join it bro just pay the light bill okay but if if I get to it first or if they send me like an alert like hey pay this yeah then yeah I'll pay it okay but I I feel like I I would pay a hundred percent of the mortgage. Okay. In short terms. Unless un- unless it was like an agreement like, yo, okay, if you want to do it this way, this yeah. way, or whatever the case may be, but like stupid shit like water bills and stuff like that. Bro, if you see it, pay it. Okay. That's yeah, I see I where he stands it. on it. Uh, with the whole 100% man paying everything, like what are you staying? Short terms. No, I mean, like I feel like we're supposed to be a team. Okay. So it's like, what I feel like whatever... We put your hands down because once you put your hands up, hey, we're gonna be talking for seven minutes straight. <laughs> Shut up. Oh my god, I feel like, 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 whatever, like, really, like Pete said, like, whatever is gonna work for my household will. Like, I mean, I feel like a man paying a hundred percent, like, that would make him feel more of a man, but then also, like, what comes with that. So like you gonna be trying to control me or yep. control. like now I have to do this you know because it was like like my papa did that for my grandmother but that was a whole different you know time. it was a different time it was affordable yeah, sure. then yeah, yeah but my papa like he used to pay a hundred percent of everything and would just tell her your money is yours mm-hmm. you know like you do what you want to do with your money and then he would still give her money to go shopping okay so it's like I understand that but it's like in these times now like it, it's not as easy as it was then so you down for helping your man yeah. Like, like we're okay. we're a team. Okay. So it's like so, if it's, if you got this, then I got this. But also we would have to be a team when it comes with like the children, the cleaning, the cooking, and all that stuff too. Because yeah. if I'm working and you working, we got to work together. Okay. So that's three. It's but perfect. Uh, 
That's three people for the uh, we not going 100%. That don't make us less men. And if you feel we are, that's cool. I ain't trying to date you no I'm way. I'm not a, yeah, a man. Right. Huh? I'm still not a man. No, he, he's just speaking yeah, from yeah, the Yeah, I didn't call 100% you a man. Yeah, I said oh. we just, we don't yeah, care about the whole. Since we agree on the. Yeah. Oh, you said there's three men. Or, I didn't say that. Oh, I never said okay. that. Okay. <laughs> you said the, the three of us. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, three people. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, and that don't make us. Yeah. So um, I mean, that don't make us less. I just said we against the we ain't against it, but like I said, how you run your household is how you run your household. Yeah, yeah. So this is my thing to all the men out there who say they want to pay a hundred percent, they don't want their woman doing this and that. I'm gonna ask you. So with that mindset that the man's supposed to pay everything, why do women go to college? So they can have something to fall back on if things don't work out with, the, with her it, man. But I'm saying if a woman wants a man who pays 100% of everything, why does she go to college? In the event that things don't work out and you have something to fall back on. When you just go get another man who's going to pay 100%? No, because it's not like it's just that easy to just go out and get a man that's just going to be like, yeah, I'm going to pay 100%. So why, yeah, it is. <laughs> so why get I mean, a, not all, no, it's not. So why get married with the mindset of if things don't work out? If they, if I mean, but there's always marriage. a possibility. Like, come on, like we in like the real world. Of course, like you don't get married with thinking like, okay, maybe this don't work out or whatever. And like you get married with the intent of being together forever. But like just being real, like in the real world, there is a possibility that things might change because like like he might not be happy anymore and want something else. You might be happy because people don't really take marriage for what it really means. Mm -hmm. It's just really like what's going on. Like what's the thing to do right now? Cause okay. I have these feelings right now. I'm going to marry you, <clears throat> but five yeah. years down the line, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> but five years down the line, <laughs> I might not have these feelings for you anymore. And I'm not happy. Now I'm on a divorce. Mm -hmm. So it's like you like being a woman, you still have to like be smart and have your own. Five years into the marriage, I are mean, you thinking be about like, divorce? It'd be yeah. like that. You're paying hundreds of uh, Instead bills? of just like trying to figure it out. Yeah. No, I mean there's a lot of stories like that. The way men's like, mm, no, I don't even want to do this. And then like the man also might get tired of doing hundred percent of everything. Like this was in the beginning. And then he was cool with it, and they like, nah, you can't just be around. You got to get up and do like that's that's how stuff happens. And I know because I've seen it firsthand. Okay. So, you, so we just gotta have our own like have something for ourselves just in the event okay. of being stuck. But I wouldn't do that anyway. So. So to the men who want to pay a hundred percent of the bills for their woman and not want her doing anything, do y'all feel like? Uh, the college education system is pointless for women because you want to do everything for her. So you don't want her getting a degree. You just want her staying at home, cooking and taking care of your children and having enough energy for uh, you when she you get home and all that type of shit. You basically saying women shouldn't go to college because you're going to take care of everything. I mean, I don't care what they say. <laughs> like, I'm not like, that's just not going to be me. Like, I'm like, because the thing is, too, like. Okay, you take care of everything. Depending on how big our house is, let's say I'm cleaning the house from top to bottom. Mm -hmm. We got probably, what, two, three children. I'm making sure the kids are together. I'm feeding them. I'm helping with their homework. I am doing their hair. I'm I'm doing everything in the house, putting them to bed. Like, I'm doing all this stuff by myself. You get home probably about 9 o'clock, and then you want me to be ready for you. But I'm tired because, like, I done did it. Everything all day. I don't know. Went to a grocery store, got all the groceries to make sure that we good. I done did all this stuff. I done washed all the clothes, folded the clothes. I mean, top to bottom. I'm exhausted now. So yep. when you so when you come home, like you think it's crazy because all I did was clean the house and do like no, that's still a big job. Yep. Especially when you have multiple kids and like however big your house is. While you sitting on the at work talking on the phone doing a desk job. Right, yeah, doing yeah, a desk job and labor. right. <laughs> manual labor because shoot, let's say we got a three bedroom, like a, a four I mean a, a four bedroom, three bath house. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm cleaning all three of them bathtubs because the kids ain't old enough to clean up yet. Like, I mean, come on, I, I got to wash the dishes and I got to cook. Like, I got to do all that stuff. And then I have to have the food ready for you when you come home and have a hot. Yeah. Man, come on. Because with, with that logic of a man paying 100% of everything, the smartest thing for a woman to do who's going to, you know, fall under that will be to drop out in the seventh grade. Because I don't know this <laughs> education shit. Somebody going to take care of me in the future anyway. I don't need like, no parabolas. Yeah. I don't need no uh, Pythagorean right. theorem. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I mean, but that's also like some of those men. Like, not all men, but some men just want to have 
someone to control. I, I was going to say they, do they, don't, they, they say. don't teach cleaning houses in the school. They, they don't. don't teach uh, really nurturing kids in the school. They don't. Uh, what else? Cooking. I yeah. mean, you might be able to get a class or two in that, but all the other shit, you might well drop out in seventh grade, find you somebody mm-hmm. who's going to take care of 100% of the bills. Listen, come on, women, y'all better start playing chess out here. But I think more... <laughs> right. I, I, think, I think the... Boy, oh boy. <laughs> but I also think the biggest thing is like when women, like when younger women date older men, they expect them to do that because an older men is... Is particularly dating a younger woman for like to feel young again Control. or right to to uh, <laughs> manipulate her in certain ways and because of the things that he want from her like the sex they think is just gonna be amazing and she gonna do this she gonna do that you know and then like you like old and yep. raggedy and but you still want her to be able to do whatever else and your money is supposed to decide so if I'm in a relationship where I'm dating a man that's older. Like, you had to take care of everything 100%, because that's the only reason why I'm here. Like, let's be honest. A man's going to know that if he's dating a younger woman, and he's, like, twice her age, or it could be her mother, father, grandfather, or whatever, he know that she's only here because of what he can do for her. And she knows that she's only here because of what he can do for her. Because of what he can do for her. So... <laughs> Like if you like, talk like man. right? I mean, I can't help it, but I mean, like that's just how they go. But when it's like us being like our own age, you know, it's like like we're together, like it's being a team. But if I'm dating a man that's like that's my daddy age or my mama age or my grandmother's age, you, you a sir, and you taking care of everything because yeah. there's no way you think I'm gonna be here because of something that you can provide for me. Besides yeah. money and taking care of me and making sure I'm good, because younger women only give older men for stability, and younger men and older men only give with younger women. Talk, no, <laughs> younger and younger uh, women. I mean, older men only give with younger women because of what they can do for them, how they make them feel. Simple. Oh, I'm done. Oh, I forgot what I was gonna say. But now I was going to say, if anything, them old ass men going to come home and be like, baby, yeah, I hope you're ready for me. You smell like Favoloso in the morning. Yeah. Come on over and get it. I said, nah, you're going to get tired of that shit. Yeah. But like I said, women, y'all better drop out in the sixth grade. Got like, hey, get you a sugar <laughs> daddy. Because that's, that's what these 100% men trying to be, sugar daddies. Yeah, no, I don't, don't do that. They want, they want that whole mindset of, I made you. Look what I did for you. Yeah. Is that not simple? Baby? Technically it is They might think Oh this man Little man well, Boy Hey you want somebody You can control That's all it is Yeah but see When older men Did stuff like that Back in the day Like how my papa Did my grandma Cause trust me My grandma was Like the King Kong of hair So like she She had it she was she good. Was the of hair? No, uh, that is crazy. I mean, like <laughs> the giant beast of hair. Like, <laughs> yeah, she was a beast. I was like, just like my mama, like of cutting hair. Like my grandmother was. She was the goat. My grandma yeah. was that nigga for sure when it came to hair. Her, they call her salon <laughs> the all night beauty salon because of how many people she had. Okay. But my papa knew that she had all that, but he still took care of everything. Okay. Cause trust me, she had a lot. She was good. Yeah. But he still took <laughs> care analogy. of her because that made him feel like a man. Yo, that analogy but, is putting me through a is. loop right it now. It is, I'm sorry. King Kong but, beast and nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Man called Beast King. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> my grandmother was really <laughs> sorry. My grandmother was really the king of this hair stuff for Why real. Did you call her a queen, huh? <laughs> Not because it, like Why it's did just... you say King Kong? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Did we have a post over there? I was thinking because I was looking at the poster. Oh, okay, I see yeah, your mind. yeah. I was looking at the poster. All right, uh, we gonna get off this subject because we got yeah. twelve minutes till we hit an hour. Oh, yeah, but he just loved God. her. That was it. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, most people don't fall in love. Anymore. Yeah, they don't fall in love. But so, he really loved her, so yeah. it's a difference. If I love you for real, like how I say I do, then we you we good. gonna, we gonna yeah. conquer the world together. Yeah. It don't, it don't no necessarily matter what. That was too long for a clip. Like you on? can make a clip, just cut, just cut a lot of what I was saying out. I mean, it's a lot you can cut out, but still get to the point. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, Can't wait uh, to see those comments. <laughs> yeah. So uh, we'll yeah. talk on this briefly. 
so they said it was a. I think it's a myth, but they was basically saying how Rosa Parks husband had a car the whole time. <laughs> yeah, I seen that. <laughs> but I, I, I seen, seen a that. statement that says like he didn't have a way to go get her after the. Listen, fam. <laughs> <laughs> Who cares? Yeah, like yeah, Joe it's, it's over, dog. Yeah. Like geez, it's over. I, but having a car not picking your girl up is funny. I don't think he actually had one though. So they they went off that picture of him and her standing by that car, and I don't think that was his car. But he could have oh, got man. that car. They could have got that car after that incident. Could have. Nobody yeah. knows. Yeah. We don't know. He, he there ain't he, a timestamp on it. He could have bossed up and, and, and got the, the whatever that car was, a Chevy. I don't know. Yeah. I just couldn't even imagine arguing with somebody on the bus and you on the bus too. Like, bro, <laughs> what the fuck are we arguing about? We both don't have no car, bro. Like, you're hey, not better than me. He ain't never oh, been yeah, in New you York. Gotta go, <laughs> you got to go to the back. Like, I'm, I'm not cool getting up. Uh, what are you roasting this shit in? I like the back. No, nah, I'm just saying, like at that time, like I can understand. I've been working all day. I'm tired. Like I'm not finna get up for you. You can sit with me, <laughs> but I'm not finna get up. But y'all still on the bus though. Yeah, we still on the bus. Y'all. Hey, bro, we as equals. <laughs> we is on the bus. Hey. White people are insane. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, we still gotta insane. get on the bus together. Like you said, oh, we still gotta pay the man. same money to get on this bus. Yeah. That's why I'm homeschooling my kids, man. Yeah. Yeah. They, 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 they can't be taught that, yeah, because that don't make no yeah. sense. Because my money green just like yours. Yeah, we both don't have cars. Yeah, everybody out in the, in the car looking like they're lame, man. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Man. Man. Yo, to think <laughs> you thought he was a, more of a person, but we still on the bus. We on the bus. Still on the bus. <laughs> hey, we still on the bus. Your man. fifty cents was my fifty cents. We both paid the fare. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, you might just got a smile when you got on the bus, and I didn't. But it don't matter. Yeah, but we going the same direction, <laughs> same way. Model uh, West End Station. <laughs> <laughs> West End. <laughs> <laughs> North Avenue Station. Yeah, yeah, what's man. in station, man? Yeah. Um, so you were saying something about a hundred dollars. All right, so I seen this thing going around on. Uh, oh, that's funny. I seen this thing going around on uh, Instagram to where the men ask their girls to send them a hundred dollars for a haircut, and then they post the responses. So if you had your girl in. You asked her and you told her like, hey, I need a hundred dollars for it. Like, can you send me a hundred dollars for a haircut? Or whatever. And her response was like, like, no. One girl sent back a dollar and said, make it work. <laughs> like, what would be your That's funny. Yeah, it was. But what would be <laughs> your your response? Like if your girl was like, nah, because one girl was like, Well, I got this, I got that, I got this, I got that. And like, what was your uh, my response would be probably I never would have sent that message because if I ain't got a hundred for a haircut, <laughs> one I'm not trying to pay a hundred for no haircut. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah. Two, like I said, if I don't have a hundred to get a haircut, hey, I got priorities. I ain't. I'm paying whatever I need to pay. Right, but hypothetically, you ask her this, and like her response to you is like, "Well, I have all this that I got to do." What are you saying? But but and keep in mind, like you've been like you know you've been holding her down. I'm finna throw it in your face. <laughs> bitch, I done got it. Oh my <laughs> bitch, I done got it. <laughs> 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 bitch, I done got it. Bitch, I done got it. Bitch, I done got it. You gotta read it like that. <laughs> 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 I know he ain't bitch. I done got it. Oh man, that's <laughs> funny. What about you? If she don't send me $100 for a haircut. It don't matter. I'm Come still staying. Yeah. Yeah, I'll not get a haircut. If me and my barber got that relationship, I'm going to hit him with that. I got you next time. <laughs> That's a fact. No. That's a fact. That's a real barber. But if I was that barber, I'd be like, next time. No. Yeah. <laughs> 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 like the McQueen. Fuck your ass. It's one girl that was on there. She just sent her, she just sent her niggas a hundred dollars. And she said, I mean, hundred dollars for a haircut is kind of crazy, but I ain't gonna ask no questions. And like, she just sent it to him. I feel like that would be me. Mm. Like, if, if you, if well, if either one of y'all was like my boyfriend or whatever, and he was you like, say, or if I had, if a, I boyfriend. had a boyfriend, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> yeah, bleep that. Out. Already, yeah, we married, yeah. And we just, all together, just, and all just bleep that out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> try to sample it. So yeah, that's lit. Like, <laughs> <laughs> nah, just bleep that out. <laughs> but. But no, so if I had a man and he was like, yo, babe, like, can you send me $100 for my haircut? I would just send it. I mean, that like, that is nuts. I'd be like, dang, 
Like what they They putting extra black stuff on? They giving you a facial too mm-hmm. But I mean here you go Like each hair yeah. coming out One by one <laughs> Extra black like, stuff Like they doing your eyebrows too Like you know <laughs> yeah, the, the Beijing uh, the They be putting oh, nah, yeah. can't do that the white, They giving you more white chalk Than normal Like what are they doing But nah I mean I would just send it I'm like alright here you go Yo new haircuts is crazy Yeah That that yeah. white chalk thing is Is, is oh, nuts <laughs> But I don't need my joint like Perfectly like some like keep it natural. Like, what, bro. What's my man name? That's the uh, young niggas stuff. <laughs> no, nah, what's no? Nah, no, it ain't. What's my nah, man it, name? it ain't. Cause I seen uh, a few grown niggas with what, that. What's the NBA? He he, Jalen. Like you ever see his shit? Jalen. Is it Jalen Rose? No, nah, Jalen Rose is an old player. That's what I'm talking about. Ain't he the one to be having the perfect hair all the time? Yeah, his hair cap, bro. That's what I'm saying. Like yeah. that shit. His hair cap, just just like uh Steve Steve Harvey's joint. Shit, look unnatural. Nah, yeah. but when Steve I say Harvey's like cap. when I say like his young niggas stuff, meaning like young barbers and stuff, like oh yeah, like doing that. Yeah, because a lot of old barbers they do not be doing yeah, that shit. Yeah, like my, my mom would be like, nah, good. I'm not doing that. Like that's crazy. Like, like what am I? Beijing <laughs> is crazy. Right, my mom was like, well, no, nah, like we gonna make whatever work with the hair you got. <laughs> we and and, and it grow naturally, and then you just do it like that, bro. Don't, don't yeah, yeah bro I, yeah. That's what I said. chalk my, my barber don't use chalk don't chalk, use the bay yeah. don't nah yeah. we my, not my we, we not use that we shit, not making it like you know yeah. what I'm saying we not making it like geometrical yeah. dog Fuck that. Roblox. yeah, <laughs> yeah. 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 Hey, what's, what's that little joint the compass <laughs> 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 we gotta nah, use one thing to make a circle nah, like bro. my mom is like that, bro. like my mom is like always going to classes and stuff to learn new things to get better but that's one thing that she's just not gonna do it's like, no, like, I'm not doing that Shape window. Shape look like a rhombus. <laughs> right, it looks crazy. And, like, sometimes with her clients, like, if they got, like, boss spot and they're trying to use Beijing, she'd be like, it, it's just time to cut it off. <laughs> like, let's I, just I cut, cut it off. It to a ball, not like a light <laughs> boss spot. Yeah, no, man. No, nah, because some, some like, it's, oil. like, no, nah, it's some of her clients. Oh, like, it's three of them in Peru with a ball. <laughs> no, nah, but it's, it's, you off. I'm sorry. Yeah, you do. Oh, we got to get these jokes off. <laughs> it's some of her clients that, like, there's, like, like nah, you just like they got the uh the sunroof. It's like nah, it's nah just got gotta let it go. Shine. Yeah, that's different. Cut yeah, that yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like like those clients, she be like, nah, it's just time to cut it off. Nah, but, but some people cut their shit when the, the corner start receding. Like if it's just light right here, you ain't got to cut that shit off. I ain't tripping. I don't want to date you no way, so you can do what you want to do. Mohawk, I like it, damn. <laughs> you ever seen that clip of a uh, homie asking what what they asked? Uh, like it's like a college, it's like a college football clip on he gets me in. With the with the black dude and he was asking him what what he asked for the uh what he oh, asked yeah, for the haircut. With the, with the white dude. Yeah, yeah, and the white dude was bald. Yeah. He was like, What you do? Tell him just keep the keep the sides. <laughs> the sides. The sides. The sides. Yeah, keep the sides. Keep the sides, bro. Yeah. That shit's like crazy. That, cut that shit off. Yeah. Oh well like a, a yarmulke. <laughs> <laughs> yarmulke is Cover crazy. Yeah. yeah, shout out to my Jew niggas. Yeah. I don't know if you're gonna have to have to tap me. Nah, shout I remember that video you. that dude put that shit on, you put it to the side, you're like, oh my bad, bro. I, he like, yeah, that's he like, it look good on you though. <laughs> yeah, my man, I was just fucking around. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh son? man, no, we shout, got. Um, shout out to them, boy. We had 58 minutes. You want to go ahead and get into the last minute and say that one for next week? Um, yeah, that's fine. Okay, well, you like you was about to say something? No, I was gonna like ask y'all like because yeah. it's, it's pretty quick to me. Yeah, but then you put your hands up and then we will be here for another 12 minutes. No, next yeah, but that. That thing with the hundred dollars, like, why not just send a hundred dollars? Talk about with them. Uh, I mean, like I said, yeah, I, don't, yeah. I don't ask people for shit like that, so I don't. Uh, yeah. Nah, like I'm just like like I said, I'm just gonna send it. I'm like, okay, but. And then and then I just me personally, really I just don't feel. No Huh? I'm sorry. No, I said okay, but but I'm like it ain't no but. I'm just gonna send it to you because nah, I want I just, my man to look good. I don't feel like asking. I mean, maybe it's different for me. I can't speak for like all men, but me just asking for something for my uh, what do you call it, like luxury or whatever, like asking somebody for, for your money beauty, to, yeah, <laughs> that type of shit. I don't even. Uh. I think most men as women just to see like where their heart is, especially like when they do a lot for them. Like, well, let me see what she's gonna do for me. I think that's probably like what that's still yeah, for. Like that that type of that that's a weird. <laughs> Thing. Yeah, that testing the relationship. Yeah, that, that's, yeah that's, that's I mean, weird, I hate yeah. the test. Like, do yeah. not test me because I'm gonna fail it on purpose. No. But I just think like that's probably like yeah, what I, it is. I quit college twice because of the test. Yeah, I ain't doing it. Yeah, nah, come on, man. I ain't go to class because of the test. Right. 
But using earlier logic, if you had a sugar mama, you could have dropped that in the seventh grade, shawty. I don't know, man. I don't think I'm built for a sugar mama. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I say fuck them relationships all together, man. If I don't you, know about that. Say, if you just want some, some, um, Pontane, you know what I mean? Hey. No. Nah, Vegas. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. <laughs> hey, yeah, shit out your sister. Yeah. Uh, speaking of uh, yeah. that, the the dude who was the shooter for the Trump, they said the last thing he looked up was uh, corn. Corn? Not actual corn. I just didn't want to say the word because I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. That okay. was his last cert. He said, that man went out there and rubbed one out before he went out there and tried oh, to take the president out. Wait, you can't say that? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. but just in case you can't. Yeah. Because I see, like, every time somebody say it in our chat, they never say the word. So I figure, like, oh. Why are they saying that in the chat? Mm-hmm. People just ask random questions. We had a lot of little kids on the live last night. I don't know why, but they just in there just being weird. Hey, man, listen. Yeah. No, yeah, but when kids don't mind, I'm not seeing nobody. I'm like, but I keep sweat. <laughs> I don't know no other than nobody. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to join the live. Okay. I mean, we waiting on the day. You done said that for like three weeks straight now. Yeah, so. listen, man. I got to build up the anticipation. Yeah, I feel yeah. it. I, say, I, I eventually want to do, like, I don't know, some type of live, just plug it. I just don't want to get too caught up in trying to read the comments while we doing the podcast. So, because I see, I see like. Uh, we could just do a live show. Yeah. Hey, well, we like, working, y'all. We working, y'all. Yeah, like like one day. Y'all ever think we're going to do the kickball thing again? Do it like once a month. Just yeah. do a live, live pod. You think so? Yeah. For sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, even me with my low iron, I'm going to get out there and I'm going to run. I mean, I'm pretty sure I'm going to get out. You you run, run, though, right? Huh? You run, though, right? No. I mean, well, like when he made me run. Yeah, yeah that's but, what I'm talking about. Who's here? <laughs> yeah, but I'm not we, a runner. We, we face that. Oh, I'm talking about... Um, my, well, when my trainer makes okay, me cool. run, okay. yes, but I'm not really a runner. Yeah, you know, we don't know him, they, yeah, word. They them, like, you're not a runner, she got track style. Yeah, we you know, whatever he said. Mm. Nah, let's get into these last minute thoughts. Uh, what the hell? Got some crawled on me. Uh, anybody want to start? Mm. How come your last minute thoughts always just a recap? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, like. <laughs> Look at the board. I don't know. Y'all, y'all go ahead and somebody else go. Uh, uh, Deadpool movie coming out this week. I just hope y'all don't disappoint. We've been waiting two damn years for it. Man. Yeah. And uh, <coughs> all the stuff, the inconsistencies. If y'all watch Dragon Ball Z, y'all see all these YouTube videos uh, revealing all the holes in the story. I'm going to go down a rabbit hole when I get home. Yeah. They said, they said uh, he used to write like kind of like a daily type of thing or some shit. Like, he wasn't one that was just, like, thought out the whole season. Like, he did it on a... So, it was just like, I'm going to write it. All right, it's out now. So, he just went on the fly with it. I feel like that's how all people do. Uh, but whatever. I feel like... Nah, but that that wouldn't make sense. Because the manga was finished way before. But I, I guess what they're saying, he did each episode with not knowing what the future... You know, like, he didn't have uh, it all thought out. So they say he just kind of went with it. That makes sense. Oh, yeah, yeah that makes sense. Oh, that's probably why it's potholes. Yeah. Because yeah. I, mean, uh, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if the manga is like more cohesive, but probably not. Uh, because like during his time, like that shit is weekly. But yeah, yo, shout out to all the. Uh, to the manga writers. Shout out to the guy we met from Japan on the live yesterday. He was like, yeah. y'all got to come here. I was like, oh, yeah, we trying, bro. Yeah, experience some of that yeah. racism. It won't, well, he was saying it ain't bad like that. Yeah, it's still out there. Yeah, you can get your <laughs> black skin rubbed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, I, yeah, yeah, you ain't got to touch me. You can just marvel at my hair. No, nah, oh, they were like, Oh, yeah, yeah, that's yeah. all me. Oh, that, that, you, that right there. <laughs> you got a hot American <laughs> arm. Yeah, yeah. You got mm-hmm. hot, hot. You really, last um, minute thought. Yeah, I'm gonna go to Disney World, and no, I don't like walking, but I really want to go to Disney World. Would you prefer Disney <coughs> World? Or, where's the Super Nintendo World supposed to be? Is that Universal Studios or Disney World? I thought it was Dubai. No, that's Dragon Ball Z uh, World. Oh, that's coming. I don't. I guess it's coming next year. We gotta go to Dubai, y'all. I got to go to Dubai. Yeah. I got to read the rules and regulations before yeah, I Yeah, because there's a I lot of stuff that you can't do. <laughs> I ain't going to say nothing. Keep my hands in my pocket. <laughs> um, yeah, I want to go to... Um, now, Disneyland, I think, is more for children. But I want to go to Disney World. I never knew the difference. 
Disney so. World is bigger. Yeah. Than pause. Okay. Yeah. And it, I think it's more. It's more for everybody. <laughs> Disneyland is like smaller, so it is. Yeah, it's like for more children. for children. Yeah, I and go then you got my... like the Magic Kingdom, but then I also want to go to Universal Studios. I would rather do that first, like if we was gonna do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wanted to like I want to like actually like go out to Florida for like a week and like yeah. go to a different, you know, like Bush Gardens, like all that. Bush like Garden I really went all that. No, well, last time I went, I was a kid, so I mean, it was yeah, fun to me. I went but when I was like six, seventeen. Yeah, cool. I was like maybe eleven or twelve. Yeah, yeah. Just animals. Yeah. Like, but I, I definitely like want to like do that. Okay. Speaking of Florida, uh, Miami might be getting a Supreme store. So, <clears throat> Florida, damn. So Florida, yeah, you'll, <laughs> <laughs> you'll be seeing a lot more of me. <laughs> that is a fact. You said Miami. They might. Okay. That's what I heard. The rumor is. Rumor has it. Okay. Shout rumor out to report. The yeah. But, All right. I don't know. Did you you do your last minute thought? Nah. Um. Let let's let's free these horses, man. Yeah, <laughs> just have them running around. around. Yeah. Right yeah, are you into on uh, like supercars and shit like that? Uh, a little bit. You ever watch the YouTubers like Quan and Raw, like the young dudes that be out here with all the supercars? Nah, never seen them. I, my brother watches them, but for we just seen them. Um, they for whatever reason they was in our neighborhood. It's a little, mm-hmm. it's a little funny to me. with the whole car thing. Yeah. Supercars at 20 is crazy though. 22 or whatever. Yeah, I mean, listen. I respect it. But yeah, yeah. Listen, they don't, don't want to get caught up like a homie that was scamming cable. Yeah. Uh, I mean, apparently they- the Hellcat do. Quan or whatever the name was. Wait, ain't, that's not him? Oh, you talking about Omni? Yeah. Omni and the Hellcat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Nah, he on some different shit. Yeah. Nah, they really be YouTubing and, you know. Yeah, listen, shout out, shout out, shout out to them young niggas, man. Mm-hmm. Young niggas. Make sure y'all check them young niggas, man. Yeah, but uh, if it ain't a McLaren or years, I don't really One want of them- I think one of them has a McLaren. I was just watching a video the other day where a dude came to Atlanta to meet with one of the young mm. dudes. And he was like, what you do? And he said, I do YouTube automation. I just got a bunch of faceless channels where I might post like Missy top 10 plays of it. And he said, that shit just generate hella money. I was like, I might start looking into that and give me some faceless channels out here. Because he said one of his channels generate like 100000 a month. So he buying a, no, he was buying a Lambo. And he was like, this is my second car. I just bought my first car four weeks ago. His first car was a Hellcat. And I said, at 20, that's crazy. But yeah, yeah shout out to them. I seeing man. all these faceless channels. Beyonce's uh, top 10 moments got there. Like, mm, uh, shout, shout out to them. Yeah, I'm about to get into that shit. I need man. that. I don't, I mean, I feel, I don't know. I don't know how that shit work when you buy supercars. Because sometimes I heard that you got to be on the list and you got to buy two or two or more or whatever the case may be for some companies but uh, I did they was like they they lease insurance would be like 140 months or some shit that's so crazy if you got good credit you can pay fucking 800 a month plus like if you doing content with the car that's where they make their money from the young YouTubers they yeah. all the car videos I'm, so. I mean it makes sense it just imagine sense. if you had a Lambo and you just start posting yourself driving every day. People are gonna be like, "What does she do?" That's gonna bring people to you. Plus, you're a female. How they already be wanting to see you now? They're like, "Shit, how the hell?" Is that, she? That's smart. Never answer the question and just keep people coming. Bro, what do you do? Oh yeah. shit, I, uh, I get money. Just never directly answer. <laughs> keep on coming. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And I'm out, coming soon, yeah, yeah, man. I'm out here trying to be mysterious. Yeah, <laughs> like hey. fucking Batman. You know what, I'm like, what that boy do? Yeah, <laughs> hey, see, I, I go to work. Yeah, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start collecting something. Yeah, I'm start collecting like Mad Batman. I should. I want to do a, a live like putting Lego set together one day because I don't have any. Yeah. All right. Paul, so, start start small. With the okay, yeah, start yeah, small. I get something that got two thousand pieces. I'm gonna be like, all right, yeah, no, okay, no, no like Lego, box. Lego, Lego makes it easy though. Okay, yeah, Lego makes it easy you because they'll have um, they'll have uh, like separate parts. So like, say it's like four bags. Mm-hmm. Like the the first half of the manual just do that. One bag. Oh, piece by piece. And two. Put them. Yeah, it's not like all together where oh, you got to look at the shake pieces. Shake them out the bottom like, damn. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, it's not like that. If, if you do it like that, this that's crazy. Too, yeah, yeah. If you do it like that, you are, you might be God himself. <laughs> yeah, I was say, my SpongeBob going to look like Doodle Bob. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, man. All right, Pete. Uh, uh, for everybody, like I said, shout out to all the new subscribers. Make sure y'all like, comment. Hey, the best thing you can do to help us out is like these videos, comment, share them with somebody you uh, who like the stuff we talk about, yeah. which is always random. So, um, Pete, yeah, and comment. Uh, if we get a hundred comments, 
on uh, one of these TikTok videos. We get that. Yeah, we, we, we get that for real? We get that yeah, all the time. See, I'm not on TikTok. Yeah. All right, so if you get a thousand comments. We get that too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So what's the number? It, 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 I say the most is probably been like four to five thousand. Like TikTok is where we at. Uh, if you said that about YouTube. If we get, if we get, if we get 7,000 comments on, on one of our videos, I'll come join the lot. Okay. Yeah. That we I gotta make it like so so we getting that traction, you yeah, know what I'm saying? It. So you know, because people want me to pop out, but you know what I'm yeah, saying? Sure yeah. Okay. <laughs> Gosh, the work. Thing. One yeah. last thing: Did you see the Kendrick Lamar game? <clears throat> Not our comments. Oh yeah. <laughs> did you see the Day Not Like Us game? Mm-mm. Y'all didn't see it. Mm-mm. Nah, it was pretty dope. I ain't gonna lie. I'm tired of that whole beef and song, but that shit was dope. Yeah. Yeah. All right, hit us with the quote, Pete. Uh, I don't really have a quote for this month. I just have a PSA. Podcasts are not for facts; they're for jokes. Depending on what type of podcast. Ah, I mean, listen, (laughs) all podcasts are for jokes. Some of this shit that people be saying be jokes. Yeah, that try to pass off as facts. Yeah, yeah, and stop bullying OnlyFans girls. That's still a thing. Yeah, you fucking weirdos. No, tripping shot it for real. Yeah, they said that in a while. But uh, <laughs> for real, shot it. Leave us out of here, Pete. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I'm about to go into a rabbit hole of uh, I'm covering these. I'm covering these <laughs> Dragon Ball Z uh, <laughs> plot holes, <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, probably go get something to eat. Okay. Shout out Bojangles. Shout out Lars. <laughs> <laughs> shout out Ray Bands. Peace, we out. Peace. <laughs> Bojangles, I got.